this particular program it is going to show that the html and the head which is the language going to be used for this okay there's the english language is used here then there's a meta data is a meta character set so we have eight that is going to be used here then there's a title which it is going to show this uh, new york central park it closes here so the link is there link is nothing but you are connecting to that particular program another program that you will be going to connect that is which is going to use the style sheet that is going to be used here as well as the dot css file okay that is a cascading style sheet files that you will be going to use that is the main dot css that you will be going to call and you are referring here then uh, there is a scripting language which is that scripting language is a js that is a javascript okay, which is that file the name of the file is being mentioned here okay. it closes always the uh, javascript that is a uh, script is written in under the head only that you should remember okay under the head ja, uh, script is going to be written then it closes body stands normal programming it is going to be here h means it is going to be in the bold fashion that it is going to display then uh, we have closing body then html okay so here it is said root element means what the first thing is going to be called as root element okay? the html element is sometimes called as root element html is root element okay now simple uh, application there is a document so whenever this particular program you will be going to execute that output will be going to see like this now i am going to show that how it is going to be you see body is there okay see properly in this h1 head h1 it is share your travels now you see share your travels it has been written in bold second line uh, new york central park h2 is there so compare this and this so automatically it is small and less uh, brighten then there is a paragraph is there photo by randy colony okay it has been written is a normal font it is going to be again this photo is conversely uh, font is there that is okay so that picture is there so that information is been written here this is, that photo uh, information is written here then after in between that only you have this central park there is one uh, hyperlink is being created in this okay so by click on this you get that particular picture and all okay the central park it has been uh, hyperlinked then after we have the strong is there means bold so okay the strong canon us 30d so that much only it has been highlighted there is a bold okay then we have paragraph is getting closer over there then image will be going to take that this particular image is being uh, shown in this then after uh, we have reviews okay s3 reviews it has been written is in the board okay again there's a division is being created for this there's a paragraph okay then time is also being written everything whatever that is reflecting here the same thing it is reflecting here except the tags tag names are going to be taken out the rest everything is going to be displayed on the screen okay so this is what the, the application is going to be there is a one uh, okay there is a always when the paragraph starts here paragraph ends okay then time starts time ends okay so like that every way that uh, strict way of uh, writing the uh, application is going to be present here okay then there is a headings again it's a repeated task it is going to be h1 h2 h3 all these things are going to be there okay so that is going to be represented in this format uh, then the browser is going to display that particular format of writing that uh, h1 to h6 is the links are there h reference you can able to link link it actually by using the anchor tags okay it means anchor tag it is so here it is been written this is h to a h reference in this format then center part this will get highlighted click on this you will get this particular center part dot com that it goes to that particular site similarly h reference index dot html we are getting this one so there is a image is there the image click on that image you will get index dot html this is the image src logo dot jf there is a jf file is there logo click on that you will get this either by the uh, text or by image that you can able to make it
There are so many types of links are there. You can uh, use the uh, anchor tags for uh, applications. Okay, there is a list is there here. We'll see. Okay, now you see that here. This is exchange site. It is. It goes to Central Park. If you click, it goes to this particular site. Then there's a uh, another way. There is um, Central Park is there. Particular uh, GIF logo goes to that particular location. Then we have index.html it, it is going to open by pressing on this home button okay home that's hyperlink then we have uh, a h references h there's a top now you see that whenever this document is going to be down like this here okay so you want it to go top click on that uh, go to top document the, it is it will be written here click on that it goes to the top of the document because it's been mentioned over that hmm? then a h reference some uh, reviews here okay so review for product so whenever that you'll be going to write like this okay so it goes to that particular location this is a reviews wherever that it is going to find it goes to that particular location and it stands over there the hyperlinks it is going to basically then uh, there's a hyperlink for a uh, mail email directly if you write like this it goes to someone click on that it goes to this particular mail id okay it is going to open this particular mail id then we have the pop up uh, window okay so there also you can able to go okay? link for javascript function this function is going to be get okay, executed you click this see this because it is a hyperlink it is only where exactly that is function is available it is going to be given over there so it goes directly to that and it is going to execute that particular program then there is a h reference for telephone numbers okay so it is going to call okay call to long to toll free number so and so it is there the same thing the same number has been written here click on this it is going to dial this so there are so many uh, links are going to be present you can use this application these things in a different applications okay there is a absolute and relative um, referencing is there basically so absolute references are nothing but uh, it's a there's a domain name will be there any path name and uh, file name all three are going to be present over there okay. domain name path name and then finally the file name to be described where exactly that it is so in this particular case okay uh, where it is huh, here so this is uh, i can say that uh, absolute reference reason is very simple okay so there's a http is a, is a where exactly that function uh, it is being located and under that where exactly this data file is there all three are going to be present here okay then we have uh, relative referencing okay so here it is going to be the url does not include this particular file okay? https if it is not there then it is going to be the path name so that is the referencing name it is going to be here for example so this telephone number and this stop this one all these things are relative referencing index that all these things are relative referencing there only it is getting uh, referenced whenever that you use the http it is called as absolute referencing if http uh, is not there then it is called as relative referencing in simple manner okay uh, the example that is being given you are relative referencing okay there is a root is there okay. index.html about then example is there images are there logo all these things now you see the here uh, a relative link is going to be okay. example.html and about.html so it is about.html is example.html how you will to write this one directly it is ah reference example.html directly it is going to be from the root directly it is coming so next if the child logo that html you want then what you should do first you should go to images ah reference images then slash logo.jf then this particular file is going to execute another one it is a background.jf okay to get to go to this particular file you need to go from css okay, then slash images slash background you see that css slash images slash background.jf this is the way that should be path properly okay so similar way that you can able to write 